Ladies and gentlemen, good evening. I'm Likabi Nathaniel from Cameroon. I want to share with you my stories about uh, the achievement of uh, sustainable development goals. You know, the professor said, today the world is interconnected. We can be affected by what happened somewhere if you are not the actors. So Cameroon is a country who live in peace. But we are affected by the phenomenon of refugees due to the conflicts that happen around the country. So in the east part and in the north part of the country, we have many refugees come. Some coming from Central Africa Republic, others come fr coming from Nigeria. So we are like we are scout. We are facing a problem. Why? Because all children refugees don't have access to go to school. Because all the schools are closed around the area affected by the conflict. So what we are doing is to bring to young refugees uh, non-formal education. What is non-formal education? Non-formal education is uh, a education that, pro that is promoted by scout, scouting. So it's education peer to peer, and uh, it's uh, a learning by doing method education. So what we are doing for those who are affected by uh, religious conflict in Central Africa, what we are doing is uh, to go with uh, youth in the camp, in the refugees camp, and then to bring the local youth so that we can uh, organize activities with them to bring them to live, to, to, to love themselves, each other, and then to break the hatred uh, chain that uh, oppose Christian to Muslims, for example, in uh, Central Africa. And to achieve this, we don't need a lot of means. It's just our availability to go to the refugees camp and to carry these activities. In the far north, for example, around the refugees camp in, my, in Minao, we have about 56,000 refugees lives in a camp. So it's become the environmental impact of these refugees is very high. They destroy all what is like trees around the refugees camp because they look for firewood and so on. So what we are doing as scouts is uh, to raise awareness of uh, the refugees on uh, the environmental protection. So what we are doing is as scouts, we go, we take the youth the young children in the, refugee, in the refugees camp, and then we plant trees together with them around the refugees camp, and we follow up uh, the growing of uh, these uh, trees. So what I want to say through my story is that to achieve sustainable development goals, we don't need a lot of means. It's just a matter of volunteer. So. Individually, where we are, we can work to achieve sustainable development goals. And we scouts, we are 40 million around the world in more than 20, 100 countries. We are working daily to achieve targets that are related to sustainable development goals. So, reimagining the world in 2030 depend on what we are doing personally, individually, to achieve the target that is related to sustainable development goals. So we can create a better world in 2030 if we act locally to achieve global issues. Thank you.